what's up man i'm back with another video today finally about to go ahead and get started man working on this chrysler srt let y'all see it real quick this thing is clean man man i can't wait to get started on this car look i love that banner like i said i bought this car from from copart and actually it was not in that bad of shape man just had some suspension problems going on with it but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get started get that taken care of today let y'all see the other side I haven't cranked it up in a while try to I'm gonna move this car out the way real quick and then I'll let y'all guys hear how it sounds Alright, I'll let y'all hear it. I mean, it don't really sound like much because it got stock exhaust. It's pretty much got everything on there stock. So, you know, that's a plus always. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and set up, get all my materials out here, get everything lined up, and then we're going to start pulling stuff off. Alright, now I'm attempt to take off my brake caliber. Just take off this here rotor. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. Get it done. Crap, man. Looks like it's probably about to start raining. It's all good, man. We still gonna get the job done. I don't know, man. They put these boats on with a freaking... with a gorilla wrenching down on them, man. I'm gonna keep trying, man, but I don't know if I can bust these bolts. Two massive boats. We're gonna have to uh, take a little tension off these brake brake pads right here. So I'm gonna have to get a screwdriver and kind of pry against it. Just when you're doing this, you need to make sure you need to make sure you don't gouge or put any big burrs in your rotor. So just be careful when you're doing that.
brake pad. There's another brake pad. These pads actually look pretty good. Got some good thickness on them. So this is the front, this is the back. No stress on my brake lines. All good. Got my caliber bungeed up. Now I can go ahead and take this rotor off. Let's try to straighten the wheel up a little bit. All right. So this thing should pull right off. Thing is this thing is rusted on here, so I may have to kind of bang it off a little bit. Spindle man, that thing is rusted to crap. That thing is rusty. Alright. Dust cover. All right. Now the next thing is to get this ABS sensor off. I think that's an eight mil. ABS is off. Ball joint separator. This is essential, man, if you want to take your stuff off the right way.
There it is. All right, y'all, I finally got everything broken loose. I just gotta head to the parts store and see if I can find a 36 millimeter socket to be able to fit this nut here. Then I can be able to take this whole thing off, get the knuckle off, and send it off to get my bush and press there. Sorry about the noise, man, truck's passing by. But uh, I'm gonna go do the, other, the same thing on the other side so I won't be recording that because it's kind of like the re repetitive motion. So uh, I'll turn this thing back on when I get both of the knuckles off and I'm about to send them off to get them pressed in. It is. It is a fresh knuckle. Gotta go get this here ball joint. 
taken off and a new one pressed in. All right, I'm going over to get the other side. All right, I'm back, man. Got the knuckles off. Got the new bone joints right here. Yes, sir. Got the new boys right there. And look at these old boys. See, I don't know if y'all can really see it, man. The sun. Look at this one, man. Look how loose. Oh, my God. Look how loose that is. So I'm glad. Uh, hopefully, they can get these out and put the new ones in. But I'm finna head down now, man. See you when I get there. What's up? It's your boy. I'm back again. This is actually another day. Um, I just got back from getting my ball joints pressed in. Finally got them back in. Um, but I can't continue to build right now because I'm still waiting on the retainer nuts to put my um, bar bearing hubs on. So once I do that, then I'll turn the camera back on and finish doing the suspension. That's going to be it for this video right here. But uh, I'll show you guys the pressed in ball joint. Here it is. Oh, man, I can't wait to put this thing in, man, and get this car put together. But... Uh, that's going to conclude this video, man. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.